By now, pre-employment background checks are so ubiquitous, most people probably assume that huge nationwide companies do the appropriate screening. But being big doesn't always mean you do the right thing. Walgreens recently got into some hot water for employing a woman as a pharmacist without checking to make sure she held a license. Kim Thien Lee was not licensed by the Board of Pharmacy, yet she held that job for more than a decade and signed off on more than 745,000 prescriptions. The Alameda County DA filed a complaint alleging Walgreens failed to vet Lee when they hired her or when they promoted her to oversee several pharmacies. DA Nancy O'Malley released a statement reminding employers that the burden is on them to conduct proper background checks to make sure employees hold licenses and are in good standing. Walgreens has since taken steps to rescreen all its pharmacy employees across the country through a new verification program. The company has also set up an annual auditing program and has agreed to pay $7.5 million in penalties. This should serve as a reminder to all employers that skimping on verifications can be a dangerous and expensive risk to take. Hey guys, have a question for our screening experts? Email it to expert at ebiinc.com. We'll see you next time.